Good afternoon. I'm Mary Calvey. And I'm Chris Raggy. Another city slashing. Police are searching for a suspect who slashed a man during an early morning argument on the 6th train. Live at noon, CBS News Magdalena Doris joins us from Grand Central and Midtown with the details. Magdalena. Chris and Mary, police say that the victim was trying to defend his wife's name and that the suspect was aggressive and intoxicated. Both of those men were fighting over a knife when the victim was slashed in the middle and ring finger. Police patrolled the six train platform in the Grand Central subway station this morning. It's where cops say a bleeding man and his wife ran off the train after a fight with an armed suspect. It's happening everywhere, so you kind of like have to be alert. According to the NYPD, the couple was riding the northbound six train at 3:20 in the morning when an intoxicated passenger started making inappropriate comments about the victim's wife. Investigators say the husband approached the drunk man who pulled a small blade from his backpack, cutting his hand. When the train stopped here at Grand Central Station, the couple was able to get off the train and flag down help. The suspect stayed on the northbound six. Across the city, slashings and stabbings are up by 20 percent, but those same NYPD statistics show knife attacks on trains are down since last year. Nevertheless, commuters are keeping vigilant, especially in the early morning hours. At midnight, you start counting freaky people on the train, so I keep to myself. I caught up with Isaac Gonzalez heading to work. He says he had his own run in with an armed subway rider two weeks ago. This individual had a pair of scissors and he was. Uh, he was look, motioning threateningly to this to this girl. She wasn't aware, but I, I saw it, and so I intervened at, at, at the time, and it shook me up, shook her up. Still, other strap hangers say they feel secure and that the subway is an integral part of a fabulous town. I think this is one of the greatest cities on earth. The victim in this early morning altercation was taken to Bellevue Hospital and has since been released. As for the suspect, police are still searching for that man. Live at Grand Central Station, Magdalena Doris, CBS 2 News.